Hello, it's me, it's Jason. Um, first of all, apologies to everyone who has been sending me emails and uh, commenting on the videos or asking me if I'm alive. Uh, yes, I'm alive. In fact, um, my aunt told me last year when I was apologizing to her that I hadn't called her in a while and I hadn't written to her in a while she said that the get the best update from me was not hearing from me at all because that meant that I was doing well and that I was living my life and that I was having a good time so I hope you all see it the same way um, couldn't be any better uh, today is my 40th birthday and um, it's uh, obviously a special day because um, six and a half years ago when I was diagnosed um, when I was 33, there was a very small chance that I was going to make it to 40. Um, the fact that I have made it to 40 uh, increases my chances for living much longer than that for quite a long time, so that's good news. Um, and, uh, gee, since the last time I updated you folks, I think I was in the hospital um, over New Year's. Um, with pneumonia, and then uh, I relapsed, and then something magical happened. I, I, when the relapse happened after two over two years of uh, past the transplant, I kind of thought that was the end. And um, in fact, it was quite the opposite. Um, we started a, um, another cycle, a few cycles of Revlimid, and I got a couple doses of the, the DLI, the donor leukocyte infusion. Um, and uh, something weird happened in a very good way and basically everything went away. Um, not only did the blood look good, um, but then we did a bone marrow and there was nothing there. And at the same time, um, I was having back surgery because I had more collapsed vertebrae, had three more collapsed vertebrae. And so they had to do more kyphoplasty on my back. And uh, unbeknownst to me, they had actually taken a biopsy from inside the vertebrae before they filled it up with cement. And the bone marrow biopsy, the blood work, and the biopsy from the vertebrae all showed nothing. And when I say nothing, I mean zero, like zero percent of anything. Um, I have someone behind the camera trying to say something. What? The PET scan. Okay, and the PET scan. The PET scan, everything said nothing, okay? Um, is what we're trying to point out. Um, and that includes the MGUS, the monoclonal gammopathy of unknown significance. That was the thing that I had in, in 2003 that actually started this whole thing. It was this awful bruising and this weird bleeding disorder. And that's what actually led to the multiple myeloma. That's gone completely. Nowhere to be found, no cancer, no precancerous cells, no anything. Um, I don't know why. Uh, I, I'm just, I'm not going to question it. Uh, Dr. Kona says that he just believes that um, we had to give the new immune system uh, a kickstart. And um, that's really what happened. So, you know, and I, the weird thing is, I can tell, you know, the person behind the camera, Lauren, um, uh, my girlfriend, I was telling her one week after, as we were, I was getting the treatments, I, I told her, I said, I don't know why, I just feel really good. I feel like, I just feel different. And it was weird. It was like this kind of fog. Any of you people who've gone through this, you know exactly what I'm talking about. You take all these meds and you get all these treatments and you get under this like kind of fog and the fog just started to lift and I just felt a little bit brighter and I felt a little bit healthier and I don't know what it was but I told her I said I think something good has happened lo and behold no joke like two weeks later or a week later the doctor says everything's gone I still have that feeling I still feel a little bit brighter I still feel like that fog is lifted so I know that things are still going well with my body that's the dog trying to chase the cat in the background if you hear this weird whining. Anyway, they're going crazy. Anyway, the point is, uh, it's all gone. So, um, basically, I've, 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 
you know, when I first started doing these videos, it was like I was doing it every week because every week there was like more bad news. Um, so taking my aunt's advice, uh, or at least seeing it the way that she sees it, um, you know, less videos means I'm doing well, or it means, you know, but um, it's not that that's not the case. Um, I, I, it's just things are going well. I can't, I'm not going to sit here and like tick off all the things off my list that have gone well. It's just, in general, I feel better. Um, my back's still crooked. Uh, as I said, I had the, sur the surgery. Um, you know, I'm trying to get adjusted to, to less medication. Hey! Um, and, you know, I'm going to physical therapy and all that stuff. The back pain is miserable. I also have this bursitis now and this hip pain and I was compensating for one thing and hurting another and all kinds of crazy stuff. But that goes on. That, that, the pain beat goes on, but it doesn't matter because um, if there's no cancer, I, I don't care about the pain. You know, I'll, I'll figure out a way to around it. Uh, I'm, I'm doing a little bit more writing. I'm trying to get into some part-time work. Um, you know, obviously I can't go back to work because of uh, all the damage to my back and my bones and all that crazy stuff. But the bottom line is things are good. Um, I'm going to keep doing more videos. I'm also going to post a bunch of videos that um, are long overdue that I've filmed over the past, Jesus, like year and a half. Um, so look out for those. Thank you to everyone for sending me the emails. Thank you to everyone who's been asking about me. And um, the answer really is that I'm doing well and I've just been living life and things have been great. I wanted to reach out on my 40th birthday. It's a big deal. It's a big milestone. Um, things are going in the right direction. I will have many more videos coming up with a lot of exciting things happening in my life that I will share with you all, um, including with the girl behind the camera. And obviously this place, you may not recognize this backdrop. This is a different place um, that we're working on as well. And lots of good things happening. Um, Keep the emails coming. I will respond to them, I promise. Um, and uh, until then, I'm just going to keep doing what I've been doing, which is uh, enjoying, you know, not being sick. And uh, every day is a milestone, and we'll just keep reaching more milestones, and, and I'll keep sharing those with you. So, till then, bye.